that next generation idea was each year from our 40th to our 50th birthday to take five students from each country, two architects, two engineers and one designer and let them have an experience on a multidisciplinary project in the other country. Multidisciplinary design for me is collective creativity. It's the bringing together of different perspectives, different ideas, different skills to get something better than you would have done working separately. It's the appreciation and collaboration across all the disciplines. You know, it's very easy to work in silos and come up with solutions you know, independent of the, the rest of the team. But to integrate those solutions, you, know, you need to collaborate. So I think that we will have um, much closer relationship, Denmark and Australia, both professionally, educationally. So being a part of this for six weeks and exploring it from every aspect, um, be it architecture, engineering, signage, wayfinding, placemaking, as Mark says, um, I'm sure that it's an example, I mean an experience that will change their careers. We, all of us are working in the built environment, but we're speaking differently about, uh, it, you know, the same thing. And seeing how Utsun applied this idea of, um, I call it experience design. It really, of course, came down to how you engage with the site, how you meet the opera itself, how you can explore it in an intuitive way. And that was really essential to us, the intuitive wayfinding, visually connecting with the site. As an engineer, it was very interesting to work uh, in the concept phase. It was rewarding actually to see, and interesting actually to see how a project evolves during time. Because normally we, we as engineers come in later in the process. This was very much a different way of working and more conceptual. We had more more influence on the project's outcome as well, which was really rewarding. The thing about that it's not just architects coming up with a vision, engineers solving, designers putting something in there, but it's really beginning to become an integrated design. I think that must have been the biggest success of the project. It's pretty amazing how a six-week program can connect you and situate you with such an incredible pool of like-minded designers and architects and engineers and mentors. The inaugural program has begun a multidisciplinary network of professionals across the globe. And it's amazing to see how a building can kind of have that effect on a people, on a society and kind of have a global reach. MADE is really a program that can shape your outlook and change your life, but only if you want it to. The most exciting things about the program is the alumni network that's aimed to be developed over the 10 years because I anticipate and I hope that I'd be able to work with some of the people that I've already been able to work with into the future. MADE represents our investment in the next generation of architects, designers and engineers, which are essentially the three disciplines that allowed the Opera House to happen. And I suppose the other thing we need to think about MADE is that it's not only the hundred students who do it, but it's the influence that those hundred students have on the way that they work, on their families, on their communities, on their society more broadly, so that it will have this continuing ripple effect across a broad spectrum of people over a very long period of time.